Hello to you all and welcome to Improvate's Clean Tech and Renewable Energy 2021 International Conference. I'm Lauren Izzo. Improvate is a platform for creating long-lasting connections, enabling change makers in technology and decision makers in government to make progress through innovation. Improvate is all about finding solutions and sparking collaborations that improve the quality of life for people around the world. Today's broadcast will be dedicated to green energy technologies and solutions. Governments around the world are investing billions of dollars to promote sustainable technologies and combat climate change. This provides unprecedented opportunities for technology companies in the clean tech sector. And today we will be hearing from energy, environment and infrastructure ministers and top experts from Greece, Poland, Bulgaria, Romania, Slovakia, Serbia, the Democratic Republic of Congo, Ethiopia and Tanzania. We will also hear from cleantech fund Capital Nature and leading Israeli technology and innovation companies, Chakra Tech, Aerovation Technologies, Maiman, UBQ Materials, Luminescent Power, Qnergy, and Finergy. And as always, watching along with us are representatives of investment funds from around the world who are looking to invest in Israeli innovation. Inspired by nature's solution for packaging, Daphna Nissenbaum is the CEO and co-founder of Tipa a groundbreaking food tech company that is paving the way forward to solving the global plastic packaging crisis. Tipa is a pioneer in the flexible packaging industry, providing a sustainable alternative to conventional plastic. Inspired by nature, Tipa's compostable packaging solutions combine superior quality with a sustainable end-of-life solution. Take a look. Tipa. We took inspiration from nature emulating how fruit is packaged, and created compostable packaging that decomposes within a few months. We tested Tipa's packaging alongside conventional plastic. Look what happened. Nature's packaging is compostable. Why should ours be any different? Tipa. Inspired by nature. Daphna, thank you so much for joining us today. And I have to say, I really love that video. <laughs> <laughs> Me too, thank you. All right, I want to start by asking you, what vision does TIPA present for the global plastic issue? And how does it offer a solution to this problem? So uh, we've been using plastic uh, for packaging around 60, 70 years now. And you know, every piece of plastic that was ever manufactured is still someplace around us because plastic doesn't go anywhere. Unfortunately. We don't know if it takes, I don't know, 400 years, 500 years, maybe a thousand of years. What we envisioned, like the movie, is to have a package that actually emulates nature, imitates nature creation. So nature also packed the orange, the bananas, the nuts, to get a package that can replace conventional plastic with a fully compostable solution that will decompose and biodegrade and will turn into na to nature within up to six months. And actually will become a new resource, which is a fertilizer, a compost, which is a fertilizer that can be used again to, in nature to grow the next uh, generation of growth. And that's, uh, that, that's what we call um, uh, organic recycling. That's, that's the vision behind TIPA, to create a, a, a viable solution to replace flexible packaging uh, with a, with a compost, fully compostable solution that imitates nature in one hand and on the other hand imitates a conventional plastic. Can you elaborate for us a little bit on the company values of TIPA? Yeah, so um, we, we've created a company to create a solution to replace, uh, to, to solve the plastic problem. Right. In, in our vision, a few solutions will exist, uh, uh, coexist in the future. So we will use recycling when we can use recycling. We will use uh, reusable packages when we can use reusable packages. And, and when compostable packages are needed, for example, in the space of flexible packaging, and that's what we'll do. We operate in a way that we develop the technology, and the technology is available worldwide for companies to use. Uh, we work on this, we manufacture on the same machineries as conventional plastic, which means that technology can be adopted almost everywhere. And, uh, and that's our vision, to be able and available for everyone in the world to use our technology. So being at the forefront of technological innovation, how does TIPA prioritize the accessibility of its solution to the market? So we, first of all, we focus on flexible packaging because flexible packaging cannot be recycled or it's very hard to recycle flexible packaging. For example, in the UK, only 4% of flexible packaging is recycled. It's a market of over $160 billion a year. So obviously it's a huge market with many segments. 
We focus on the food industry because the food industry is the number one contributor to plastic waste. And within the food industry, there are so many uh, segments and different products. So we start with the ones that are mostly used and are most, um, uh, and composable uh, packaging solutions are most suitable for those segments. And we plan to, to grow from there and to expand more and more to, to at the, and at the end of the day, um, to offer our packaging solutions to all uh, different types of flexible packaging. Very interesting. Daphna, thank you so much for joining us today and thank sharing you. with us all about your company. Really appreciate it. Thank you very much. Thank you. That's it from Improvate's International Clean Tech and Renewable Energy Conference. We've heard today from Environment, Energy and Infrastructure Ministers from Israel, Europe and Africa, from top experts in the field of renewable energy and from leading Israeli technology companies. Improvate is all about access and connections, exposing Israeli tech leaders to governments and companies around the world to promote businesses whose goal is innovation. The exposure right here at this conference is the first step and the next step, delegations and real world business connections. We want to thank you all for taking part and hope this is just the start of doing business together, making technology accessible to all and improving the lives of people across the world. Keep an eye out for Improvate's Homeland Security Conference on April 12th. I'm Lauren Izo. Thank you for joining us today.